Hello, everybody, and welcome back to Vintage Story. My name's Skriddle, and we've got a lot to do today. So I think first things first, uh, I mean, we're, we're kind of in a sorry shape uh, from last episode. Lost a lot of materials, and uh, we're going to have to make some better preparations. Uh, what I think uh, we'll do in the meantime, though, is we do have to get a little bit of food in us. A little, a little more than a little bit, I guess. Uh, hmm. I don't want to make a meal quite yet. Yeah. But I do think that we actually do need to uh, uh, check on the farm. Got to check on the farm. Got to check on the animals. Kind of see where everything lies. We spent a fair amount of time away from the... Uh, where are my knives? Knives! Uh, need a counter in here. I spent a fair amount of time away from the uh, the, the homestead here, so we're, we're probably a little bit behind. We, we were unfortunately a little underprepared for that fight, but hey, you know, we learned. We learned things. And, uh, oh, don't need that. I need this. And that can go back, and that can... That should go over there. There we go. Okay, and we'll grab the scythe. Ooh, that scythe's not doing so hot. Probably gonna lose the scythe here. Let's see if we gotta go. Uh, see if we have anything that we can go and uh, uh, harvest here. Continue making preparations for winter, and uh, we're gonna have to make some preparations for our, our venture back Oop. because I need my stuff back. I'm not gonna take that loss lying down, but I'm also not gonna take it standing up because we just need stuff. We got here rye, spelt. Uh, cabbage. The cabbage does really well out here. Mm, oh. Rye's almost done. This, oh, the soybeans are done done. Okay. The flax is almost done. Probably harvest those. The carrots are done. Okay. Rye is done. Oh, the flax is like almost, almost done. We need the flax so bad for the windmill. Oh, and the turnips are done. All right, all right, we'll do a little harvesting here. All the turnips are ready, but you know what? Let's do what we can do. Right, take what we can get. We got to prep for winter. We're gonna have to. We're gonna have to use our knife. Uh, do a. Little, do a little quick harvesting here. Uh, Spooky, you think you might be able to go until we're Ugh, back here. So I've got some copper in the kiln here, so we'll be able to smelt up some of that, get some ingots. Uh, it took me a second to actually get this hooked back up and figure out how the heck this actually goes. Uh, so that this will uh, be able to pound out a flat plate, and we'll be able to make ourselves another scythe. But while that cooks, it's actually almost done. While that co cooks up and cools down, we'll go out and check on the aminals. Be like, hello, aminals. Boop. May as well do a uh, pickaxe while we're here. Because we could always use more pickaxes. We're actually getting, for the first time in a long time, we're actually getting low on copper. Which is uh, wild, to say the least. Put this back. While well, those cool. Okay. While well, those cool, we will go out and check on the aminals. Hello, aminals. Wait. Wait, which one of you grew up? Ready to mate. Uh. Oh, you're not. No, no. Mean. Also mean. Okay. I mean, I rescued you as a baby, but it's fine. Uh, you need food. Maybe that's why you're ornery. You're just... You're just a grumpy goat. Grumpy sheepums. Alright. Okay. So the sheep are growing. They're not mating yet, though. I don't know how I... I don't know how I make them do that. I suspect... Oh, my lantern is gone. That's why it's so... That's why it's so dark. 
because I don't have the lamp that I was always carrying. All right. So for the most part, we're actually doing pretty good. Hey, eh? we're doing pretty good uh, food wise. We're, uh, we're pretty well stocked up. We don't have a lot of meat, but meats uh, meat is something that is a, a bit of a, a bit of something uh, we can't just store. Where like these will last right through the winter, um, and some of this stuff. Thir I mean, thirteen years. Thirteen years is a long time for something to last in the uh, in the storage bin here. So uh, I'm not too too terribly worried about. Uh, about any of our stuff going bad, but uh, I, uh, I I do think we're going to need to have, figure out the meat. Unfortunately, our our sheep's aren't uh, they're not they're not getting on with it. But that's 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 for them to decide. I, I can't I can't force that upon them. I don't think I don't I don't think I'm supposed to do anything. I, I think I'm just supposed to like wait. Yee. All right. Fresh, fresh morning. Little, little pear for breakfast. We can get out and about. Actually, we'll grab a little bit of food for our, our exploration. I do. Uh, I do think that we uh, need to see about finding ourselves some. Oh, take the berries. We need to find ourselves a. Um, a good chunk of uh, zinc, so that way we can make uh, more uh, uh, bronze. Let's see, what's this actually? Alum, alum. Uh, let's see, where did we see zinc? Wasn't it uh, in the Southlands down here? My phone. Minuscule, minuscule. Hmm. Truthfully, I don't know if it's just like if it's just worth it to just like start charging in blind into places. Just being more explorative. Uh let's see. Like is it is it worth it to just start jumping around in, in some caves? In hopes of finding <laughs> more uh, more resources, I I still don't understand the prospecting pick. Uh, I, I I like I conceptually I get it, but uh, it, it just doesn't make enough sense to me to to make it worthwhile. I, I'm certain that there's a whole bunch of people out there, and probably a couple of people watching this video that are screaming at their monitor saying it's so easy how do you not understand it you fool but I just just don't uh, let's see so anyway while well, we run on over to here you figure give you guys a, an update on uh, on life life and things and things and stuff um, we have gone for our uh, we've gone for the next uh, most recent uh, ultrasound for, uh, for for baby Scrittle. and uh, so far so good. Everything's looking great. Little baby's got uh, got got a face now, so we were able we were actually able to, to see tiny baby face, which was incredibly exciting. Um, both me and Spooks are extremely oh that's sulfur. Both me and Spook are extremely excited. Um, I, I honestly excited is a is an understatement. We are more than just excited, but uh, it is it is pretty wild uh, to watch uh, watch the little monitor light up and and see a uh, a new life form coming into the world. Watching that whole thing start to finish. So I'm I'm, I'm frankly I'm just over the moon about the whole thing, but uh, but uh, everything's going good so far. So we are we are. Uh, Oh, oh god. We are all all green lights. All uh, all good news, all excited. You don't know who's not excited. This guy. Stinky. 
I remember when I was scared of those. I'm not scared of anything anymore. I fought your boss. He beat me up, but I fought him. Mm, this looks like I got all the tin out of here. Or did I? Hey, alright. Could you not? Uh, I think this is actually our last bronze pickaxe. So that, that's certainly going to be a problem. Um, but I think we have to figure out how to make the, um, the armor, the, uh, plate armor. And that is, uh, that's what's going to help us in that, uh, that fight with the immortal th thingy. Which, a couple of people said that, uh, killing him does not, uh, does not let us tear apart the archive and uh, collect all of its delicious, delicious resources for decorations. Um, I am choosing to not believe you, and I'm, I'm going to keep on the assumption that killing him will get me my stuff, because I want bookshelves, and I want chairs, and I want beds, and without all that stuff, I will be very sad. Mostly because there, there's really, there's just no way to craft it. You, it'd be nice to have it. Cause I, I, I just I need more blocks. I need so many more blocks. I will say though, at, the more I, the more I play this game, the more I am, uh, uh, I guess becoming familiar with the sounds, with the, uh, with the, the creatures, with the aesthetics, and it's. It, it's kind of like when you first uh, when you first roll load up this game, everything's new and terrifying, and you're you're frankly like too scared to go into caves. And uh, we've we've come a long way. We're not we're not we're not we're not uh, fear f fearful little scrittles anymore. No more no more fear pits, except for the one for temporal storms. Um, but that's a trap that we're trying to make work still. I feel like uh, I feel like we're making a lot of progress. I do know uh, steel is like the next step up. I, I'm not sure. It, it seems like it's it's uh, quite a bit to get going. Uh, once we have the setup, it, it seems like we're able to kind of constantly roll through it. You have to make a bloomery, if I remember right here. Are you dead? You are dead. Are you dead? <laughs> you are now. Did I? Yeah, yeah, yeah. Hey, I'm trying to. I just want to get through. I wonder if I just forgot about this stuff. It kind of. Oh, copper ingot. I mean, we'll we'll take the box too, just cause. Uh, eh. Could always use that. Ooh. Ooh, boots. God, I want these beds. Now, actually, I just saw. Look at that. Look at look through this wall. Ooh, that's pretty and decorative. But through this wall is more stuff. Look at that. Another bed. Now our bed can match. Oh, full. Uh, I don't need brown coal. Like I, I want these books. Uh, I could probably take the Jonas parts too. Ooh, what's in here? Whoa! Noble leggings. <laughs> I'm gonna take rich man's pants. Get out of here. Okay, wear that out of here. Take it. Take all your money. Ooh, flower pot. See, this is what I'm talking about. Decorations, upgrades, pe Whoa. Ooh, lore. Decorations. We're taking them. Okay. And there's 
copper down here. We're get, we are getting low on copper. But we're gonna have to we're gonna have to leave the copper here for right now because we are ooh, We are filled to the gills with stuff and things things stuff and things and things and stuff and stuff and stuff with things are things. No, I don't I don't actually know what the sulfur is for. I think it's a fertilizer. And I think it's part of the lasting thingy. Um but uh lasting thing. The the ore mine. Which the ore mine I it says it works on ores but not on rocks. So I'm wondering if it's something that just like instant mines the whole node. And if that's the case, that would speed things up a lot. Hello, Mr. Raccoon. Yeah, I'm stuck in a tree. Alright, back home. Now, uh... You know what, the, the, we're gonna do decorations up in the bedroom. Uh, let's see. So we have like a flower pot. I guess we could just put here, and I think we got a bigger one here. This guy can go like that. Get rid of this bed. And we'll toss it over here. And this bed will go here. And now we have... Well, I kind of thought it was going to look more like, uh, like two beds together. Kind of kinda doesn't. Because, like, this bed does look like two beds together. This bed doesn't. But it lets you sleep for longer. Hmm. How did this go? I think this way. Yep. So it's, it's now the story is, is uh, uh, you're in the woods and there's a, there's a spooky green guy. And then you you're like, whoa, that spooky green guy's over there. We should we should go back into the village and and we'll make fire and that'll keep the spooky green guy out. But then he summons in his flying bat children, but they're shocked because you're you have fire. Um, but then uh, and then because because you had fire, uh, you're able to overwhelm him and you give the spooky green guy a spanking. That's why he's on the. That's why he's that's why he's bent down. He's he's getting a spanking. At least that's. I, I think I'm 99. Like I'm no archaeologist, but I'm like 99.12 percent sure that that's exactly what's going on. Time to read a book. Oh, it's not a readable book. It's just a book. Book. Okay, so on for the uh, for the vanity project thing. Uh, I'm not quite sure where to put it yet, but in the last episode. Or the episode before that. Or maybe before that. I'm not really sure. But in one of the previous episodes, I had mentioned that I wanted to uh, start incorporating ideas that you guys had for the house here. Because, yeah, we got we to add some we gotta add some flavor, some zest, some pizzazz. So for the for the flavor, the zest, the pizzazz. All right. Spook wanted a... I'm going to come straight across here. I'm going to dig out a little room. I'm not sure how big this room's got to be, but by golly, we're going to make a room. But Spook had requested that we make a uh, a display room for all the gemstones that we find. So, I think uh, I think that's a great idea. We'll do up a little room, some some nice uh, some nice glass. There's actually um Oh, I guess it's just going. There, so there's stained glass uh, in this. Uh, uh, so to make stained glass, it seems like we just kind of smash up uh, any of the gemstones that we already have. So like, like there's green. I think there's a pink one. Yep. Which is rose quartz. We have not found that yet. Uh, I know we found diamonds. I'm not sure what diamonds actually are good for, truthfully. Uh, sure, give me diamond, diamond purchase. Da, da, da. Yeah, it's purely just a thing that we can have. Uh, how do we make red glass? 
I, oh, I have to buy it. Oh, of course I do. But that's fine. We'll buy some stained glass. Um, however, uh, I think we can uh, we can do up a, a nice room. And Spook will be like, "Wow, that's a that's a room." And we'll just uh, we'll do we'll do super fast dig mode, uh, so we can get get this room cleared out. And. <laughs> little guy and then we go like that and we go <laughs> well it's it's a little less impressive uh, when they're so small <laughs> but but what oh god I forgot to eat I thought I got attacked again but proof of concept and then this this all be glass got our got our little gemstone room started I gotta make a whole bunch of display cases. I think I can make, I think I can make small display cases. Though I don't think I need tall ones because the the tall ones make the gemstones look small, and I don't have small gemstones. I do too wish we could we could like put the the crowns and stuff out for display. I don't I don't think we can unfortunately. Let's see this. Display case, tall display case. Is there any other display cases? New. No. So we just gotta make a bunch of glass. Okay, glass it is. These done. They're done. Well, they're still hot. They're they're hot glass. Nope. Oh, okay. It can be in your inventory, but not your selected thing, I guess. <laughs> Whatever. Uh, if I grab this. Does that... Yeah, that works. Okay. Can I place them? Is really the question, though. Yes. Yes, I can. Okay. Okay. Um... Actually... No, we'll, we'll leave that one there, I guess. There, now it's all display cases. And now... Now we gotta get all our gemstones. These, there we go. Right, let's see. Which we have a fair few, and I, I don't think sulfur technically is a gemstone per se. But you know what? We're gonna display it. Unless Spook really doesn't want me to. Alright, so we got olivine. Olivine. Uh, you know what, we'll do a couple more. And then maybe some emeralds. Maybe this one gets mixed up a little bit. Yeah. And do some... A lot of greens. A couple of chunks of yellow, I guess, wouldn't hurt. <laughs> you know, for sure, a piece of quartz. I think as we find things, we'll uh, we'll make it look a little nicer. Uh, I think that's it. 
to fill them all up with quartz. I, I wish we could we could display the the crowns and stuff. It, it appears though that we cannot because like like here's a crown and a totally empty display case and wait a second you can put the crowns in here well this changes everything I mean alright I mean she really just wanted the gemstones spooked really just wanted the gemstones in uh, in here but I mean maybe 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 not those maybe the crowns are okay Oh, and the and the bracelets. The bracelets gotta be okay, yeah. Spook, you can tell me if the bracelet's not okay, or if the crown's not okay. If it's if it's just supposed to be gems, I threw the bracelet on the ground. If it's just supposed to be gemstones, then it, it can be just the gemstones. That's okay. This item does not fit into the display case. Okay, well, does it fit into this one? No. What about this? <laughs> okay. So the bracelet doesn't fit? Why does the bracelet not fit? Why? Come on. Come on. <laughs> Go in. Fine. The bracelet doesn't fit. I think I can put the resin in there either, because that—that's where I draw the line. That's when it would be silly. Let's see, do we have any other gemstone? We have diamonds, another emerald. That's this, basically. Let's see if we can cram those in there too. Zoom. Doop, ba doop, ba doop, ba doop, ba doop, and ba doop. Oh, I didn't know. That was, that was, that was. There. All right, Spook. I know it, it needs a it needs a chandelier in here. We're gonna have to go buy a chandelier. Probably needs a couple more torches to be totally safe. Maybe maybe you gotta pick a different floor or something. Uh, or or I can just continue the cobblestone. I kind of like the cobblestone floor everywhere, but that's that's up to you. But. What? What do you what do you think? What do you think, Spooks? You got yourself a gemstone display room. That's sole purpose is quite literally just to display the gemstones that we find. I'm pretty happy with it. Could use a could use a little more work. Some wallpaper maybe. The wallpaper's hard to come by. Now you got a big bay window. We can see out onto the farm. The farm animals can look in on our opulence. They can be like, wow, look at all those rocks that are shiny. <laughs> but unfortunately, guys, I think that does bring us to the end of today's episode. I uh, want to thank you guys for watching. Please subscribe, rate, comment, love it, like it. And as always, I'll see you in the next one. Bye bye. You making angry noises? Hey, don't make angry noises out here. I'm trying to film a video. Get, get back here. I'll skin you dead. You don't give me anything, jerk. I'm just making noise for nothing.